Oh yes. Let's go. It has shipped. The GoPro has shipped. It's a little bit echoey in here because it's a staircase. My camera is in at the office, so I gotta go get it, but it's 1.30. Closing sucks. It's literally only 2.30 and the sun is already so low. It has shipped. The GoPro has shipped. Uh, I expect it to arrive Monday, November 14th. See, I just feel like, I feel like when it ships the day after I order it, it's gonna come in a little sooner, I would think. Today's only f Thursday. This is a very, very exciting time. Ever since yesterday, I ordered the GoPro yesterday. Since then, I've come up with like at least three video ideas to use the GoPro for. I've got, I, I, I... <laughs> So very excited. So very, very excited. The first GoPro I ever got was the GoPro Hero 4. And it came out September 24th, 2014. That's eight years ago. Wow. My reason in saying that is that's the last GoPro that I got. The the big sell for that one was 4K. And that's like, that's mind blowing because this one shoots, the newest one shoots. I think I said 5K. But it's a million bajillion times better. But the last time I got a GoPro, I made a whole vlog about the GoPro. I talked about the GoPro, I used the GoPro the entire time. So, one of the ideas that I had is I'm going to make another vlog exclusively using the new GoPro, using for every shot I get, everything. The whole thing is gonna be shot on the GoPro Hero 11. And it's gonna be it's gonna be really good, I think. I think it's gonna be really exciting. And that's also gonna help me get a feel for, first of all, just using it, and also how it's going to work in a bunch of different settings, because I'm gonna use it the entire day. I may even do a whole week test, like I'll do Thursday through Sunday exclusively on the GoPro. I don't know. That's an interesting an interesting thought. It is like five o'clock, almost dark. Vlogging during daylight savings time is gonna be a little wacky because like there's not gonna be much lighting to speak of after five o'clock. I think today's kind of one of those blood kind of days where it's just kind of like feeling, you're just feeling <sighs> seems like those always, for me, always seem to fall on Thursdays because I close Wednesday nights. Don't get off until 4, so. I'm just really excited that the GoPro shipped. That is something that really has just turned it around for me today, honestly. <laughs> It's getting dark, but I just thought of something. So the GoPro 11 has what's called horizon lock. I've talked about it a little bit before. Something I didn't realize was that it's actually kind of OP because what you can do is it'll lock your level. So like I could take the camera like this, but the GoPro would leave it, like the actual video, it would just stay like this. Like it would be like I wasn't moving the camera at all, but I would actually be taking it and moving it like that. That's crazy because I could do something like this. You know, it'd be some little walking shot kind of like that. I don't know. I think that'd be kind of sick. Just to experiment with all the different things. I'm excited. Let me know in the comments below if you would like to see... So I, I said I was going to do a GoPro vlog with just the GoPro. Should I do just one vlog or should I make it four? Each vlog that week be with the GoPro. And if it comes out Monday, that would be perfect because I could just make the vlogs that week. I think I might do that, but let me know your thoughts anyway. <laughs> So the last GoPro I bought, I bought it off of one of my old baseball coaches, a good friend. It was the GoPro Hero 4. It came with a whole bunch of gear. Here's the camera all by itself. 2014 finest. My point in saying that, or in telling you about this, about him selling me all of this stuff, all of the extra gear, is that even since 2014, GoPro Hero 4, all of the mounts and rigs and little bits and bobs, accessories, things of that nature, they all remain compatible. You don't have to every year go out and buy new, new clips and new this and new that. You just have to get the new camera and create. They're not like Apple trying to sell you the new charger port every year or the new AirPods or this or that or the other thing. They're just simply making the best product for you. As though it seems to me. Having this prior setup I think made the investment more worth it because I'm more confident in my abilities and what I would use it for and like how I would use it. It'd be dark. It'd be nice and dark out here. 